NDI stands for non-destructive inspection. How I explain it is we're kind of like doctors for aircraft. So there's, there's scheduled maintenance, like a scheduled checkup, and then there's also um, things that happen. So that's like a random occurrence, pretty much, you know? You fall over and you break your leg, you go to the doctor. So since these aircraft, the RQ-4 specifically, is composite, we're making sure nothing's gonna crack during flight and potentially be a catastrophic failure where the pilot would be lost or the, the aircraft would be lost. The main ways we do that is we do uh, quite a few different versions of inspections. Every base has their own ones that they are more specific in. Uh, here at Beale Air Force Base, we mainly do penetrant inspections and then what is right here, the mouse inspection. So we're using ultrasonic inspection, which is shooting sound into the part and then a, uh, a device is waiting for the sound to come back and it's creating an actual physical image. Uh, this is a very specialized uh, version of ultrasonics. Only two or three bases in the Air Force use this version. We, I'd say we are the, the lead though. We're producing more with it than other bases that are using it. The entirety of the wings, the V-tails, all the parts that we inspect, since they're all composite and they're all these giant areas, I mean, this sometimes takes a week or two. If you were to do it with just a single transducer, it would take you months. So it helps tremendously because of its, its rate, its, its how many transducers it has, and everything like that. So with that image that we get back, uh, we're able to tell based on different colors on the screen whether the part is defective or, uh, or separating. We'll forward that up to an engineer and then the engineer would say, okay, that's good, or say, say what type of repair for our sheet metal guys to come out and do. You're really helping the mission because this, this happens here and then it goes right back. You, not only are you um, supporting everybody in the AOR, but you're helping the Air Force be the world's greatest Air Force. So.